Any storm that has lightning can be deadly. So the big question is, how does lightning form? Well, it's all about getting the charges, which are all around us, to separate. And here in a thunderstorm cloud, we got to focus in about halfway up. About halfway up a cloud, there's a magic range of temperatures between about 14 degrees and four below zero, where several types of precipitation can exist. The snowflakes generally have a slightly positive charge, while hail in this area would have a slightly negative charge. Now also in this thunderstorm cloud is what's known as an updraft, where wind moves up and away from the ground and up through the cloud, and it picks up those lighter snowflakes. So you have the snowflakes going to the top of the cloud with a slightly positive charge, and hail either staying put or slightly sinking with a negative charge. And eventually, that area of hail can get big enough that it even induces the opposite charge here on the ground. So you start to see positive charges collecting, especially on those tall, pointy objects. When those charges get separate enough and big enough, then all of a sudden, you can get lightning to form right on through. We'd like to see your weather experiments and answer your questions. To do that, go to weather.com wizard and upload via eyewitness.